A state of emergency is declared in Rolling Hills Estates as a catastrophic landslide continues to threaten more homes. Tonight, more homes have been evacuated and officials say the ground is still moving. KTLA's Carlos Acedo joins us live in Rolling Hills Estates with the latest on the landslide and the emergency declaration. Carlos. Good evening. We are on the other side of the canyon tonight just to give you a different perspective. Now, I've been out here the last three nights and I see as these homes, these properties continue to slide, continue to sink into the canyon below. Tonight, more evacuation orders have been issued. This as the city declared a local emergency. Homes on Pear Tree Lane and Rolling Hills Estates appear to be hanging by a thread Tuesday evening, days after their foundations began crumbling. Neighbors have looked on in disbelief. I am really distressed kind of at the moment, especially right now. I came to just look at the site and that really hit me. I hope somebody will help these people because, you know, they are their lifetime investment there. The city has taken swift action. The council unanimously approved a resolution declaring a local emergency to help those affected. If you uh, declare a state of emergency, then the homeowners can be eligible for grants, state and federal funding, even some local funding. So it's, uh, you know, it's just another effort on our part to try to step up and help them through this. Officials say the land where the sinking homes are perched has slowed, meaning the multi-million dollar properties might not end up in the canyon after all. But the sewage line has broken in five other houses, which must be evacuated, bringing the total now to 17. If the earth has stopped moving and some of them are on a plateau, you know, they're pretty crumpled. You've been up there and seen that, but um, they, um, you know, it's possible that they at least can get in and get their things out. But a geologist must first come in to determine what's causing the land to shift, and it could be up to two weeks before they make their findings. The topography, the steepness doesn't really change that fast, and neither the rock type never changes, so it's really got to be something to do with the water. Again, 17 homes now under evacuation orders, but city officials say that the land movement has slowed, which of course is a positive update. That's the latest tonight in Rolling Hills Estates. Carlos Salcedo, KTLA 5 News. Carlos, thank you.